The following team members joined Hilti in 1980, and we would like to recognize them for 35 years of dedicated service. John Donnelly. John's first job with Hilti was Assistant General Counsel. Since that time, he has served as Director of Human Resources and Senior Legal Counsel, a position that he has held since 1998. Outside of Hilti, he enjoys spending time with his wife of 44 years and reading books on military history. After 35 years of dedicated service, John will retire in February. The good book tells us that there is a time and a season for everything under heaven. And then it goes on to give a number of examples of beginnings and ends of a life's journey. It occurs to me that often the beginning and the end uh, occur at the one and the same time. And that is the situation for myself this evening and for my fellow retirees. I think that gratitude is a greatly underrated virtue, and sadly, one that is, seems to be going out of fashion. Now, you millennials here tonight, listen up, because this is important, okay? <laughs> like Bucky, I could start with Ewald Holker and go down the years and thank a lot of people, but I have I distilled my thank yous to five. <clears throat> one. In the late fall of 1979, I came home and told my wife, Peggy, that I wanted to uproot her from her beloved New England and move the family halfway across the country to the heartland, far away from her Atlantic sea air and the sacred soil of Fenway Park. <laughs> she has long since forgiven me Forgotten, no. Forgiven, yes. <laughs> For being supportive of what I now think of as my great Hilti adventure, of being supportive every day, I thank her and for everything in our 44 years of married life. <clears throat> Carrie Everett abhors a public compliment almost as much as he loves praising other people in public for their accomplishments. And so I will save my conversation with Carrie for <clears throat> a private uh, meeting uh, in hopefully in the near future. But when I have that private meeting with Carrie in the near future, <laughs> I intend to tell him how much I appreciate all he has done in his 35 years for Hilti and for Hilti's people. And I will tell him. <clears throat> and I will tell him that immeasurable, that is incapable of being measured is my respect for him as a leader and as a man. Third, I often speak and then think about what I should have said. <laughs> this happened to me a few years ago when I blurted out to Carrie that, well, I, I work for the best boss in the building. And then I realized that, well, Carrie's a boss and Carrie's in the building and maybe that wasn't too cool a thing to say. But where Kelly Beaver, our general counsel, is concerned, I retract not a word. It's been 43 years since I graduated from law school and I have never known 
a finer attorney. Nor have I ever worked <laughs> nor have I ever worked for a more honest, ethical, and decent human being. I can sum this thank you up in five words. Kelly Beaver is my hero. Four, in the video I made a, a references, two of them actually, tonight to the people I work with. And, and there's four people that I, colleagues in the legal tax department that I have worked with daily, uh, not for years, for decades. <laughs> Marty Schofield, David Sires, Jerry Medcalf, and Tom Horan. Gentlemen, it's been a privilege to serve in your company. And finally, to you, Hildy, to those of you present here and those absent, to Hildy people of the present and the Hildy people of memories past, to those of you who get up in the morning and in the heat and in the sleet, put on your Hilti collar and go forth. With the name Hilti on your breast pocket, where in gratitude near your heart it should be. And to those hundreds of people who support you and to all of you, I, it's why I can say without reservation that Hilti has done far more for me than I could ever have done for Hilti. <clears throat> Hilti, God bless you and God love you because I sure do. God, that was